the following is a segment from the Carl King Podcast. If you enjoy this show, be sure to like, subscribe, and send us burritos. I wanted to ask you about two older songs that you composed, Mm -hmm. and tell me how you might explain parts of them. Okay. Uh, The first of them is Rats with Wings. Uh Um, (laughs) The chorus melody, I've got a bunch of notes written down here about this, so let me just spew them out. Okay. And you you can tell me if I've got this right or... Or what you think. The chorus melody like fits perfectly over a one, six, four, five earth angel in like E flat major. Uh-huh. And so the melody would be like a super consonant and tonal and pretty, but instead you, it seems like maybe you reharmonized it with these four chords, uh-huh. E, fl- e flat major, C major seven, and then this mystery tritone stack with A and an open E string and then a B flat Lydian type of chord. Uh, <laughs> and you ended up with this clashing dissonant thing and the melody over the C major seven ends up making this 11th. Uh-huh. So I know that's a bunch of data, but <laughs> how do you arrive at something like that? Like, did you write the nice consonant melody first and then reharmonize it? Or how would you explain it to a student? I believe that most of that, most of the, that record and, and I'm sure that song was like, it started with a guitar part. Um, you know, I was writing a lot on the guitar, so I probably, what happened, I don't know if I can totally recall how I wrote that, but I'm pretty sure I wrote the guitar part and then, um, you know, and I wrote all these melodies to be sung, you know, and I, so sometimes I would, I would, um, I would, sometimes I would compose a melody. I'd be like, oh, you know, I'd like sit down and like figure out what I'm was doing. Other times I might just try to sing something over it and see what comes out of there or, or maybe do a combination of both. Like maybe I'd sing something and be like, ah, oh, that's too, it's too consonant. Like what if I go up a note or something? And, and so, but I'm pretty sure that like that, those, that melody was uh, written after the chord progression. Total, total opposite of what I thought. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. And I mean, I guess the fact that it comes that the melody comes out being this consonant thing is i mean i'm trying to i want it to be like singable and like and kind of catchy you know but i'm still kind of you know messing around with weird harmonies so um i mean that's kind of my favorite stuff really like oh yeah ca- catchy and weird <laughs> If you enjoyed this segment from the Carl King podcast, remember, you can also listen on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or through an old rubber hose.